Good morning, you guys. Charge it to my heart and not my head. I was talking to my mom while I was cooking and making my Salisbury steak. But this, hold up. Let me move all of that. All right. So this is what it's looking like. I have flipped them over. That's onions, peppers, mushrooms. I also put onions, peppers, mushrooms inside the patty as well if you can't see and I'm just going to cover this and just let the meat finish cooking for a little bit and then I have my kitchen bouquet browning and sauce with some flour cornstarch and water and this is going to be my gravy I did season this uh, slurry or mixture with uh, salt, pepper, sea salt, pepper, and I am going to add a little bit of garlic powder in here and a little bit of onion powder. There we go. Just a little bit, not a lot, baby girl, just a little bit. So that's going to be my gravy. I have rice from yesterday, vegetables from yesterday that will go with this meal. And the see, it is cooking up. I'm just going to kind of move these mushrooms, onions, and peppers around a bit throughout the patties. Once I add the mixture, the gravy mixture that I made, I will put this on low and let it cook for about maybe an hour on low. Um, also, I don't know why I have that out. I'm not using that. Also, here is the chicken soup. See the spinach, celery, and carrots, and chicken. I have one container of reduced fat chicken broth as well as some water. Seasoned it with salt, pepper, onion powder, garlic powder. And that is soup. Once that gets close to being finished, I will then add a couple pieces of spaghetti. And that will be good to go. Um for probably have this for like lunches throughout the week um as well as a couple dinners i do still have fried chicken left i got three drumsticks so when i'm ready to eat that all i got to do is heat it up in my air fryer and it will be good to go and yeah so that is dinner for the next couple days lunch and dinner for the next couple days and i will see you guys soon be blessed have a great day and stay positive bye y'all yum yum oh that steam but it if you guys could smell this oh you guys oh before i go i know i said bye already but before i go i put i seasoned the meat with Sasson seasoning, adobo seasoning, sea salt, onion powder, garlic powder, uh, some breadcrumbs, Italian style breadcrumbs, and, and an egg. I mixed it up like I would a meatloaf. Normally with the meatloaf, I will put in some ketchup and mustard. I did not do that for this though, just because I know I will be adding the gravy mixture. So, alright, I'm going to sign off now. I will see you guys later.